programming a Centurion SDA4 sectional motor. I'm going to show and explain how to set up the limits on the motor. As you can see at the back, it's busy flashing LLTU. That needs to be changed to LLSS because we're using a sectional door and not a tip up door. Pretty much just press plus or minus to change it. Ah, there you go, SELL. That means we're going to be programming a sectional door. We say confirm. Got to make sure that your door is in the halfway position. As you can see, our door is in the halfway position, so we can commence with the uh, programming of the motor. Got LL on the screen. Press confirm. The motor will now start closing. We have set up our end stops on the shaft. Uh, I'll show you where those end stops are just now. That they will stop the motor once it's in the correct position. There we go. Door will stop. Now it will open. Always walk with your motor. Just in case something goes wrong in program mode, you can pull the cord and put the motor into manual. Well, the door into manual. Override the motor uh, and then pull the plug on the motor. Right, there you go, it's at the end stop, now it'll close at normal speed. You yeah, just how quiet this motor is. Such an awesome motor. Right, programming complete, that's your limit which have now been set. Once the limits have been set, um, It'll go to a single dot to confirm that your limits are set. Just press the light, it acts as a trigger. The door will now open. Got a nice soft start, soft stop. Press it again, door now closes. We'll program in the remotes now as well. Each SDO4 comes with two remotes, which is yeah, that's actually quite awesome. As you can see, if I press the remote, they're not programmed into the motor. To program them, you've got your learn button, give it a quick press, it'll show O1 and then RU. Press and hold the remote button until you hear a beep and the RU flashes. That's remote number one programmed, do the same with the next remote. Remote programmed. You can go out of program mode if you want to. I normally just leave it for about 10 seconds and it automatically goes out. There you go, light flashes four times, out of program mode, remotes have now been programmed.